Okay, that's nice and submerged. Okay, so see what's happening right here? This is hydrogen being released. I want to make sure it's not current limited. Okay, so now we're etching. You can see on the power supply, you know how I was talking about voltage versus current? Right now we're giving it 12.5 volts. And in terms of the current, it's, it's taking 3 point something, 3.2 amps. But that's because this is kind of acting like a short circuit, right? The water conducts electrons. They flow from here to here, sort of in the way we think about it. They actually flow the opposite direction. But so what this basically is, is oxidization sped up. So this is like a time-lapse video of something oxidizing. You guys know when you combine water and, and some, you know, certain types of metal, you end up with this sort of oxidization mm -hmm. layer. And eventually it makes that metal brittle and it flakes away. So that's what's happening right here. We're just accelerating the process by energizing it. So we're energizing it so that electrons can flow more freely. And they did that with mint clusters. Did they? Salsa. In salsa? Yeah, they uh, ate through these uh, bars of the prism. So you can see how if I scoot it closer and closer, it draws more like and more current. What? See? Four, four amps of current. Three amps of current. You see this? Your finger in there? Are you in trouble? Um, <laughs> it, it gets warm. I mean, I don't know what kind but of trouble you're in. But not electrocuting. Uh, yeah, I don't think you would be electrocuting. I mean, right now the you're not. You know, right now when we talk about right electricity being lazy. Right now the resistance of your skin so is higher than the resistance of this mm. electrolyte mix. Don't stick your tongue in it. <laughs> yeah, your resistance is probably lower. Yeah. And you're great ground, you know what I mean? Like, you can store a lot of electricity inside you, so don't let it stay. Um, you remember card? Oh, oh, did it? So, so uh, <laughs> <laughs> so will copper work in the same way? Will it turn green faster? Well, uh, what my understanding is that with copper, instead of using uh, an electrolyte, well, you still use an electrolyte, but instead of using salty water, you use something